Have you ever found something that didn't belong to you? Picture this, a ball is making its merry way down the road, carefree and unclaimed. Along comes a man who spots the wandering sphere, his curiosity piqued, he reaches down and picks up the ball. Has anyone lost a ball? He calls out, scanning the area for anyone who might be missing their spherical companion. But alas, the silence that ensues tells him he's the ball's temporary guardian. With the ball in tow, the man heads home, a new artifact added to his day. Evening descends and as he settles down for a bit of TV time, a story catches his attention. It's about a boy, a boy with a lost expression and a missing ball. The boy's sadness is palpable through the screen. The man looks at the ball he found earlier, then back at the boy on the screen. A realization dawns on him. Could this be the same ball? Without wasting a moment, the man sets out, the ball securely tucked under his arm. He tracks down the boy and presents him with the lost ball. The transformation in the boy is immediate. His eyes light up, his lips curve into a smile, and his hands reach out to reclaim his lost treasure. The joy in the boy's eyes mirrors the man's satisfaction of reuniting the boy with his beloved ball. So what's the takeaway from this story? The man's actions highlight the importance of empathy and kindness in our everyday lives. He found something that didn't belong to him, but instead of keeping it, he took the time and effort to return it to its rightful owner, and in doing so, he not only restored a boy's source of joy, but also experienced the incomparable pleasure of doing a good deed. In a world that often feels divided, it's these small acts of kindness that bring us together, create connections, and make our shared world a happier place. So the next time you find something that doesn't belong to you, remember the man in the ball. Who knows, you might just end up making someone's day a whole lot brighter.